let's go ahead and take a look at Sound Iron. I love Sound Iron's uh, instruments. They really come across in a fun way. This is their harpsichord. And I just pulled up the basic. Um, so we just have just the one layer activated. Here we go in. We're, we're Baroque again. And if I'm correct, you know, the blue keys are right here in the middle. And then we've got the green, the turquoise, the lighter. So the darker blue keys are what uh, was actually sampled. And then they've stretched them out. Uh, so the turquoise keys represent the more stretched out. Uh, So layer one, we've got uh, close mic position at the bridge. We've got the soundboard. And we've got the ambience, layer, and then subsense. They give us some really cool things that we can just layer these on. And so I'm gonna go back and let's just do the close mic on layer one, layer two, let's do the far mic, and then just gives us. And again, this is very dry. This is a very dry, dry capture harpsichord. And let's see, we've got, got plenty of effects and let's put on the uh, reverb. Very cool. And I like that they give us the standard samples and harpsichord things, but then they give us these custom effects that take it to another level. Clouds of Synth. Now this is a custom effects preset, and this is using the ambiences, layer one, layer two, another ambience. And yeah, so we've got all kinds of ambiences layered here. That is huge. Believe it or not, Eric, yeah, this is the harpsichord. But as Sound Iron does, they take the harpsichord or whatever core instrument they're sampling and they take it further. So the ambiences that uh, are included are derived from the harpsichord samples.
And we can go ahead and take one of the layers. If I can find my mouse here, but here we go. So let's take one of the layers, which is an ambient, and let's put the close. Got a little little popping I think it has something to do with the sustain pedal sending out all the continuous data but that's amazing that is amazing because <laughs> Yeah, this is the this is the harpsichord, but uh, Sound Iron takes takes things a little bit beyond what you would intend them to be. Yeah. And then the mod wheel is mixing between the A and B layer. Reminds me of Manhattan, uh, no, Manhattan Transfer, uh, Mannheim Steamroller. So that is a lot of fun, and and if you uh, if you want to pick up one of uh, Sound Iron's instruments, you can always use the code Praise Tracks to uh, save a little bit more, and and that uh, just kind of helps to support the channel in a little in a small way. And we've saw. Uh, We've seen Mannheim Steamroller a couple of times, and it's a lot of fun. Wow, that's a lot of fun. 